Right, we got something different for you today. We've come to Newsham Park Asylum. Me and Emma have been here before. And found ghosties. Mm, but today, you've got the daughter and the fiance. Ghost them. So, you looking forward to it? Yeah. Well, Lydia's not too sure. She's a little bit, hmm. <laughs> So we've literally just put a post on Instagram about 20 minutes ago um, asking people did they want us to vlog this for YouTube. Everybody's been saying yes. Yeah. Um, I thought they'd say no. I thought they'd say no because it's not van life. No, it's, it's not vans. But we do go places. We are basically in a hallway now um, waiting to find out what's going on. There's quite a few here isn't there? A fair amount of people, yeah. There's more here than there was last time when we come. Yeah, it was a small group, wasn't it? But Lydia wasn't here last time. You excited? A bit now, yeah. You, you excited? Yeah. Yeah. Lydia's Just excited. Don't Daisy's come excited. Near me. So. I do the yeah, apparently, who have you brought? Jesus. You brought Jesus? With Jesus. This video is not sponsored by <laughs> Sky Daddy at all. <laughs> Right, well we've just been on a brief tour and um, we are going to be able to let loose on our own, aren't we? Yeah. At some point. And we it's can go good. around, we can have a look around, but it is a massive big old building and you definitely need to come and see it if you can. If you've not been here before, we don't know anything about it. Newsham Park Asylum, get in line, have a look. We're going to go back upstairs now, then we're going to get loose and we'll take you around. Let loose. Now, the last time when we were here, um, <clears throat> they took a photograph from this position here and we were all standing right there we were all standing right there in the end of this video we will show you the picture um, we'll give you links to the picture and you'll be able to see the picture we'll put me and Emma out but it was from this hall right here make what you will of the picture if you think it's a ghost if you don't think it's a ghost, there you go. Mm. So we're now going with the Ouija board into the locker room. So if anyone has been to Newsham Park before, this is the infamous locker room. Now, there has been plenty of sightings of things going on in this room. People have seen things, stuff's happened. Um, mainly because this is where some of the staff that used to work here that may not have been very nice used to come and talk about the things that they'd done to kids or patients so before this was an asylum it was an orphanage but it was basically ooh, commissioned by seamen and merch ship ship owners and merchants because they were worried about families and kids that have been left behind so there you go so it wasn't always an asylum so if you are in a room where now and you want to spell your name out just please spell your name out start with the first letter of your name is there anyone in this room please don't be eddie it's on the e it's on the e it's eddie. so it's, it's e. eddie isn't it is it, is eddie? it eddie is your name eddie edward edward emma eli Emily. Eddie. Emily. 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 Eddie. Emily. 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 Hello, Emily. Emily. Did you live here, Emily? I don't think it's Emily. I think it's Eddie. Is this Eddie? Where are we getting the name Eddie from? It's all over the lockers. It's, all over, it's E. Yeah, it's all over the lockers before. Is it Betty? Oh. Betty. Wow. Betty. Hello. Oh. So as you can see in the background, the girls there are doing the Ouija boards. We do think that there's someone in here called Betty. Um, whether you believe in Ouija boards or not, that's entirely up to you. But We're gonna put it back in the, the reason I have stepped off is because someone will go, oh, it's Neely's pushing the glass. Um, <laughs> these three are quite trustworthy and I trust Hello, everything Betty. that they're doing. If you are in the room with us, move the glass that's on the boards that the girls have got their hands on. It might be better that it's just all girls on the board. Or did you like Neil? Did you like the sound of Neil's voice, Betty? It's 
So were you a child here? Are you a patient? Yeah. So you were a patient? So now we're going further up into the asylum, up into the very top. Right, so what we're going to do now is some table tipping. Basically, you just put your hands on each corner and then we can see if we get the spirit to move the table. I keep smelling a burn. I smell it now. I smell it more now. Go on, try and knock it over. Who's touching that? I'm barely touching it. Yeah, I'm barely. I thought it was me as well. your hands. Is that you rocking the table, or is it Neil rocking the table? It's, it's Neil rocking the table. Rock the table for us. Is it the kids? Yeah, it might be the kids. I think it's the kids. You think yeah, it's the kids? Kids, it's kids play, play. Kids play more. Caretaker would just boot you in the shin. Yeah. He'd lob the table. Like. <laughs> you that rock definitely it moved then. That definitely moved. That moved towards me. It, yeah. I felt the bottom you, of it move. Do you want us to go? You, you want us to leave you alone? You move that whole table, and then if you want us to go, you got to move that table more. Or if you want to stay, rock it. So these cupboards were basically where the caretakers used to bring the kids up into this big hallway, which you can see there. And they used to basically put them in these cupboards for hours, days, weeks, whatever they felt was necessary for the kids to be, you know, taught a lesson. You'll see how small they are. So you imagine being a kid, like <laughs> a small kid, and being sent into this. I can barely stand up in this cupboard, and this is what we used to basically put them in. And they could be, they could spend days in here, hours, weeks. Like I said, it just this could have been kids with like. ADHD or learning difficulties or things like that, but at the time, no one knew any of that was, you know, it wasn't a thing that it wasn't brought out into the, the public or no one knew, so they were just classed as naughty kids, which is quite sad. So uh, what's, what's happened to you? You, uh, you tell him because he won't believe me. The ghost's like Lydia, it's clear. Yeah, you want her in the cupboards? They, they basically had the table up onto two legs and then it tilted over onto one leg trying to get Lydia in the cupboard. You like Lydia? You like Lydia? Put it up onto one leg. Put it onto this leg here. Still wanting to go in the cupboard with you, don't you? I'm sorry, but I'm not going in the cupboard. Do you like the sounds of Lydia's voice? Do you like my voice? Table. And now we can see. Whoa! Can you move the table back down for us? Put it back on the floor. Put it back on the floor. Back on the floor. You're alright. If you've got problems with ghosts, <laughs> give Lydia a call. I'll get them. I can move your table for We've just finished the table tipping. I table tipping. Table tipping. I know you were kind of freaking out coming here, weren't you? No, I know, but I think it's a really cool experience. It's um, it's something you don't expect, isn't it? No, I know, yeah. No. Right, we're doing some um, glass moving now. and um, We've got a couple of things in here as well. The ghost people call these KO2 meters. It's an electromagnetic field meter. It checks electric pulses. Tape to be yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh, oh. Okay, keep it on. Keep it on the table. Keep it on the table. And then is my side no? So if you come over, that's no. <coughs> oh, 
Okay, so this is no. So, oh, and in the middle is um, is the floor is lava. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Are you are you a child? Are you male or female? Male. Do you want the man to leave? Was he confusing you? Is he silly? Asking silly questions. Yeah, they want the man to leave, get out. Do you like that man? <laughs> Does not like that man. So it's official, ghosts don't like me. The people in the room next door. No. Yeah. Oh. No, they didn't feed you one. Well. Was your dad a seaman? He was at some point. <laughs> Can you throw the glass off the table? Can you do that for us? Do you have a girlfriend? A little girlfriend ghost? A little boyfriend ghost? A little girlfriend. <laughs> See, I was taking the piss then. <laughs> No, oh, because I said, I said oh. that you got a little girlfriend ghost or a little boyfriend ghost and when, we, when you said boyfriend ghost, flew at us. They're watching that when it flew across them. Your fingers were literally barely on it at all. It looked like they were just being dragged by the tips. That was for the so part we're of you like an adult. the asylum or the building we are in now someone. is basically the psych ward. It's one wow. of the psych wards. Do you like being here? Were you punished for something? Are you under the age of 10? Are you over the age of 10? Are you a teenager? Are you an adult? Are you over 20? Are you under 20? Are you... Are you 18? Are you 19? We're officially on our own now. Left free to wander. It's like one of those ones they had in churches, isn't it? Yeah. That does not look like a relaxing chair at all. <laughs> oh my god, that's pleasing. Oh, oh, oh. Do you know what's missing off that bed now? Yeah. Do you know the straps? Yeah. Strap for the ankles and the arms. That must be freezing. So Daisy's gonna put herself in a basically an old like they've died bed coffin thing. So you gonna close it up? I'm not closing it up. Oh, no. This is the machine that they used to give people basically electroshock therapy. Fry the brain. So you probably used to sit them in that chair, wire them up to this, which is a mega therm, and then um, yeah, crank up the volume. I wonder how many people have been tortured on this device.
So this side of the asylum is basically where the nurses were housed. Yeah. And you can you can kind of tell because <laughs> it's a little bit nicer than the other side. Not that it's nice, but you know. Look at that carpet. Oh. <laughs> oh. Sexy. We were told that there was places that we can't go, um, but they're meant to be locked. We don't know whether this is one oh, of them. Yeah, no. this, you're not supposed to be here. Oh, I'm sure you haven't seen them. Yeah, but look at that. You know you've got to go up there. No, no. I'll go. Not a chance in hell I'll go. Bye bye. <laughs> bye, Neil. Well, that is Newsham Park Asylum, or Children's Home. Orphanage. Orphanage, Children's Home, Asylum. Betty's Crib. Hospital. Mm. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. It's different, isn't it? Yeah. We, we have been, I mean, the kids have been to Denby. What do you think? Does it compare to Denby or? Mm. About to explore more. Yeah. Mm. You do get, if you do come on one of these tours, you do get to go and have a look around me and emma have been on two of them now there's been a little bit more activity on this one yeah there's in been more places. stuff going on but i think the first time around it just felt a little bit more spooky because yes. we'd never been here yeah um, it wasn't as it wasn't as lit no either. there's a lot more lights here and there's a lot more people here this time i will say that much yeah than there was last time we came there's a lot more people there's double the people and um, but there's going to be a picture on the screen right now that's the ghost. That is there in that picture is meant to be a ghost. There's me and Emma, just there, just in the picture. That's us. We're gonna get gone now. Um, we're going to some other funky places like Williamson Tunnels and you know wherever we go on our travels. Hopefully, we're gonna go to Scotland and um, explore the places that the trolls wouldn't pay to go in. <laughs> bye bye. bye, -bye.